You hardly know Teresa Ethan, and you don't even know her friend at all. You're still jealous that I said Teresa's name when I was sleeping. You're the love of my life, Gwen, not my mother's personal secretary. I know Teresa's not a rival, but how can you say for sure what she's capable of? Teresa is our housekeeper's daughter. Pilar Lopez Fitzgerald is the most loyal and honest person I have ever met. She would never let her daughter do anything to hurt the Crane family. Well, can you say the same for her son, Luis, as well? Okay, so Luis, the handcuff happy cop, has it in for the Crane family. But Teresa doesn't, or she never would have taken a job here. Maybe. Besides, and you can tell by looking at her what a nice girl she is. She's got a good soul like her mother. I hope you're right, Ethan. It's over, Gwen. Frank's off the case, and as far as I'm concerned, the stalker problem is no more. Look, trust me, Teresa. The only thing going on between me and Frank the P.I. was the third degree. Oh, forget it, Whitney. I knew all the signs. I saw the way you looked at him. You've got a thing for him. Just because your life plays out like some romance novel doesn't mean mine does, okay? Besides, even if I did like him just a tiny little bit, it wouldn't do me any good. And why not? Because he thinks I'm a liar, which I am. Well, I'd rather the guy like think I was a liar than a dreary little mouse the way Ethan thinks I am. I have got to get out of this disguise. You know it's not safe. I don't care. How many hours of the day do you think I can stand to look like this? I'll change in here. Teresa strikes me as the kind of girl that figures all the angles. Her friend is different. She's more honest, more open. It's too, it's too bad that I had to meet her under these circumstances. But didn't your boyfriend Frank love to see me out of this disguise? He'd recognize me in a second. Do not call Frank Lomax my boyfriend, okay? All I am is a suspect to him. Sooner or later, these girls are going to give themselves away. When they do, I will be ready. Well, if you did like Frank, I'm sorry. Because we've definitely seen the last of him. He's out of our lives for good. And I couldn't be happier.